Atlanta Hawks Malcolm Delaney, left, tries to get the ball away from Oklahoma City Thunder's Russell Westbrook, right, in the third quarter of an NBA basketball game in Oklahoma City. Friday, Deck, 22, 2017, AP Photo, Kyle Phillips, Oklahoma City's late game offense is fairly straightforward. Give Russell Westbrook the ball, bunker down in a corner. Watch him careen into the lane or settle for a pull-up jumper and try to get into position to grab an offensive rebound. That hero ball and lack of ball movement has also put them in a bit of a bind throughout this season. Against an Atlanta team that had the worst winning percentage in the entire NBA, their ISO offense was a curse. And then a blessing, with 4.21 left, the Thunder appeared to have the Hawks in pocket taking a 107-99. However, the Hawks spent the next four minutes chipping away at the lead, until tying it at 111. Unfortunately, the Hawks left 11 seconds for Oklahoma City to play hero. However, Westbrook smelled blood in the water, with possession of the ball and 11 seconds left. Called his own number, Dribbled out the clock for nearly 10 seconds and drained a parabolic jumper that left only one. Seven seconds on the clock. It was only enough time for Atlanta to inbound and heave a length of the court shot. The Thunder's nail-biter was the culmination of a rare efficient scoring night for Westbrook. However, don't be fooled by Westbrook's 30 points on 12 of 17 shooting. 15 assists and buzzer beater against a bad team. It never even should have come down to one shot. The Thunder are still exhibiting low basketball IQs in close games. Westbrook's shot went in this time, but a pull-up tray by a 30% three-point shooter. As Carmelo Anthony, Paul George and Stevens Adams operated as stone gargoyles and decoysy is a relatively poor shot to create out of a timeout. Against stiffer competition the Thunder will still have their work cut out for them in late game situations and nothing appears to be changing.